ABC Chief Medical Correspondent Dr. Jen Ashton, as always, tracking all of the major developments with us right here. So let's take a look at some of the latest numbers from Johns Hopkins University. Now at least 37.8 million confirmed cases of coronavirus. That's worldwide. The U.S. is still the leader in diagnosed cases with more than 7.8 million. And now more than 215,000 American lives lost. And uh, hospitalizations rising in 35 states now. So there's a new, renewed emphasis on testing, right? right? We've been talking about this. We, we don't hear as much about it because we, maybe we think we've gotten it right. down and maybe that's not the case. So some new research here about some new methods. New methods, and it really speaks to innovation that's occurring right now in voice recognition software for COVID. So take a look at this. There's research going on in Israel, also being done in this country on vocal analysis. They're using machine learning to look for something called vocal biomarkers, basically changes in the voice of someone who may have COVID. Now, I want to be clear, this is intended to help with triage. So does that person need a test? Not to make an actual diagnosis of acute illness, but it has been studied in neurodegenerative disorders like Parkinson's hmm. disease and Alzheimer's disease and really, really interesting, you guys. Wow, fascinating, sounds a little futuristic. <laughs> yeah. What are the concerns with this? Well, first of all, as with any method, there could be erroneous diagnosis here. Um, you know, it's possible that there could be privacy issues. This is still in the proof of concept stage, um, but it does show just how much innovation is going on right now worldwide to battle this virus. Oh, wow, Doc, that is fascinating. You know I love that. I know you do. Geeky stuff. <laughs> All right, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.